Coronation Street teases another sinister and killer Stephen Reed storyline. Coronation Street spoilers follow. Coronation Street has teased another sinister death in killer Stephen Reed storyline. The serial killer has already taken the lives of Leo Tompkins and his father Teddy. Plus business rival Rufus, and has more recently eyed up business contact Owen and future son-in-law Tim as potential targets. With Stephen now at odds with Tim over the latter's concerns about his marriage to Elaine. The murderer has considered his future wife to become one of his victims too. In Monday's episode, the 1st of May, Elaine had agreed to rush off to Las Vegas that very day to elope with Stephen since she was on the outs with son Tim. Sally and Tim were horrified when they heard about the news, so Tim offered to drive the couple to the airport so he could stop his mum from making a rushed decision. Tim pretended he'd accepted the couple's marriage plans, but when Elaine got into his cab, Tim sped off. Even though Tim made a convincing argument about Stephen's dodgy motives, Elaine refused to listen and demanded to be taken home. Once back on the cobbles, Elaine relayed to Stephen what Tim had said and then started to feel faint because she'd not taken her blood pressure pills. High blood pressure, my mother had it, I do too. She was younger than I am now when she died, Elaine explained to Stephen. Stephen tried once again to win over Tim by promising that he'd have a prenuptial agreement written up to ensure that Elaine's money was protected. However, once he was alone, Stephen applied for a life insurance policy on Elaine so he'd be the only one to benefit if she met an untimely demise. Is Stephen planning to kill his soon-to-be wife? Coronation Street airs on Mondays, Wednesdays and Fridays at 8 p.m. on ITV1 and streams on ITVX. Read more Coronation Street spoilers on our dedicated homepage. You might also like Animal Crossing New Horizons is finally announced on Nintendo Switch. How to watch Amazon Prime on your TV, smartphone and tablet, and enjoy good omens online. Nintendo to release two new Switch consoles this year.